To configure the NX Legacy Open Loop Daylight Sensor, simply select the Legacy Daylight Sensor you want to configure from the list of discovered devices. The screen will change, displaying the name of the sensor and the current daylight level, as well as the sensor range. You can change the name of the sensor or continue with the default name. Next, set the sensor range to match the daylight sensor settings. For detailed instruction on setting the daylight sensor settings, refer to the Daylight Sensor's installation instructions. Next, choose the Daylight Harvesting Zone to be configured and select the desired Daylight Harvesting Mode. Once completed, select the Save button to save your settings. Test mode allows for the sensor to be tested using a flashlight or other light sources pointed at the sensor to quickly verify that the sensor is responding to changes in light. No setting is required. To set full range daylight harvesting settings, First, set the design level. This is the level the artificial lighting system has been designed to provide. Turn off the artificial lighting. Using a foot candle meter, measure the light level at task and enter that value as the at task level. Next, you will need to adjust how the sensor responds to changes in daylight. Adjust the ramp up time to control how quickly the sensor responds to decreases in daylight by increasing the amount of artificial light. Adjust the ramp down rate to control how quickly the sensor responds to increases in daylight by reducing the amount of artificial light. A faster ramp up time and a slower ramp down time are recommended. Select the groups you want the daylight sensor to control and press the save button. To set on off daylight harvesting, select on off from the zone one mode select drop down menu. First, set the design level. This is the level the artificial lighting system has been designed to provide. Turn off the artificial lighting. Using a foot candle meter, measure the light level at task and enter that value as the at task level. Next, you will need to adjust the dead band percentage. The dead band is the amount of change allowed near the set point to prevent cycling when daylight levels are fluctuating near the set point. Finally, you will need to adjust how the sensor responds to changes in daylight. Set the on delay to the time the sensor will delay turning the artificial lighting on once the daylight has fallen below the set point and set the off delay as desired. A short on delay and a longer off delay are recommended. Select the groups you want the daylight sensor to control and press the save button. 